Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to remove your background as well as your room echo from your streams and recordings in OBS Studio 28 using NVIDIA Broadcast natively. So let's get started. All right, so the first thing that I'm gonna have you do is actually download the SDK that you need. So you have to have an NVIDIA card to do this first of all. So what we will do is uh, I'll include a link for this site right here. And for the video effects for the background removal, uh, you'll need to download one of these. And for audio effects, it's one of these. If you have a 30 series card, this is your video and audio. But me, I have a 2070 Super, so I was used this video effect right here, the bottom one for 20 series, and then this audio for 20 series as well. And I will leave a link for those. So download the appropriate ones. And then once you install them, you should be good to go ready in OBS. Now, so what I'll show you is uh, how NVIDIA Broadcast currently works is you need to open up the software down here, open up NVIDIA Broadcast, and then, oops. And then this is where, um, so in here, this is where you would set your, pick your camera, set your resolution, and you could change your background blur, replacement, removal, etc. So as of right now, they've just introduced background removal natively into it. So I'm just gonna keep this on background blur because that's how I use NVIDIA broadcast. But in here now, so I've got my camera set up. This is how I have my NVIDIA broadcast set up normally. So in properties here, uh, I'll switch it over to the Logitech stream cam so you can see. So we'll switch that. So this is my Logitech stream cam, no filters or anything right here in OBS right now. So what we will do is you need to go to uh, your camera properties. No, sorry, not your properties. Click down on filters right here. And then in your filter section, you can add an effect filter and you will have this NVIDIA background removal. So if I click that and click OK, now you can see that my background is no longer there. And you can do this by quality where it's better quality but higher GPU usage, or you can do it by performance where it's easier on your G GPU but not as good of quality. It shouldn't matter too much. We'll go for performance for the tutorial of this, for the purpose of this tutorial, I mean. So the threshold you can also change. I've noticed it doesn't make a difference unless it's at 0 or 0 0.05 as soon as you hit to 0 0.1 uh, all your background's gone anyway so uh, you could probably keep it there so it's not as intensive or somewhere in the middle of the end it shouldn't make a difference just play around and see what you like so I have NVIDIA background removal and now just like that you can no longer see the background that I had here so uh, let's say you wanted to add a camera frame um, you would add your image You've got your camera frame here and I'll show you how this looks. So let's say this is my camera frame. This is me and I wanted a virtual image. Now that I've got my background removed, I can just add a regular image. Let's say this Minecraft. And we will put this below our camera here. Drag this down to the appropriate size here. And just like that, you have a, your own built-in green screen without actually needing a green screen. Thanks to NVIDIA Broadcast with OBS. And you do need OBS Studio 28 to do this, so I'll leave a link for that in the description as well. And then now, if you wanted to do this with uh, your audio settings and your noise suppression or echo removal, what you can do is you would go to your move the rest of this up so it's not in the way. Uh, we could actually probably just, for the sake of this video, we could probably get rid of this. And you don't need that or that. All right, so now on here, uh, what you do for the audio removal is go to your microphone, whether you've got it as an individual source or if it's set in your default settings, it'll show up here anyway. It doesn't matter what you use. You can just right click on it, go properties, or sorry, filters, you can right click on it and choose filters. 
And then in here, you would add a noise suppression filter. You can just call it noise suppression. And then in the method here now, you have the option of NVIDIA noise removal, NVIDIA room echo removal, and NVIDIA noise removal plus room echo removal, whichever you would rather use. But those are NVIDIA broadcast features that, again, you don't need to be running the actual NVIDIA broadcast software anymore to be able to do this within OBS Studio. Hopefully this video helped you uh, with your virtual background and your green screen that you don't actually need now in OBS. Please let me know if you have any questions or if something's not working for you or if there's any other OBS content you'd like to me like, would like me to cover. And thank you for stopping by and enjoy your new trick.